Good morning, Wildcats. I'm Kia Collins. And I'm Victoria Chambray, and these are your daily announcements. Hey, seniors, are you planning to go to college and need some financial help? Miss Mason will be hosting a FAFSA completion workshop with you and your parents on October the 15th at 5.30 p.m. Even if you feel your family will not qualify, many scholarships require you to have it filled to qualify. Don't miss out. Rachel's challenge began in the wake of the U.S. first school shooting, Columbine, in 1999. Rachel Scott was the first young victim of that horror day. Instead of giving in to fear and grief, her family used her passing and positive demeanor to change school culture and climate throughout the United States so that no other family would feel the pain that they felt. Poe High School Club uses the guidelines and messages from Rachel's challenge to try and change the culture here at Poe High. If you would like to be a part of this change in your school, our next meeting will be today at 315 in Ms. Thompson's room, Hall 102. We hope to see everyone there. It's homecoming week. Thursday is drip or drown. Drip in ice, a.k.a. your bling fine jewelry, or drown in your water pool gear. Friday is homecoming shirt day. Wear a 2019 homecoming spirit shirt. The coronation starts at 6.30 before the Wildcats take on the Shawnee Wolves on Friday at 7 p.m. Come out and support your Wildcats. Ponca City cheerleaders are hosting the homecoming after party at Ponca Bowl from 10 p.m. to midnight. Tickets will be on sale in the Commons for $5 or $7 at the door. You must have your student ID to enter. And now for sports. Cross Country will be having a meeting at Claremore today. There will be a volleyball game today at 4 p.m. versus Sand Springs. Come out and support our team. And that's all we have for today, cats. Have, have a great, great day and go, go 